Hello and welcome to the Steam Weekly Chart Show with me, Bon Bon B. I'm Bon Bon B. You're very, very welcome. It's the 27th of April, 2019. On this week's chart at number 20, we have Stadler Flirt OC Transpo 10 cars by Rev O. Some more train assets for your train collection. At number 19 is the one lane two way tram road cobbles by Black Wolf FRDM 920. I always like a few extra tram assets, don't you? At number 18 is the Cathedral de Chien Fuego, Fuegos, possibly, by Peter Barr. Yes, my Spanish is as good as my German. And we have some German to follow. At number 17, the One Lane Highway by a Die Hard Hunter. Die Hard Hunter producing some roads to go with all those lovely cars they keep giving us. Thank you, Die Hard Hunter. At number 16, Prague Row House Trasnitsa 2 by Geoglyph. Definitely something uh, becoming up a bit of a theme from Geoglyph. Thank you very much for these Prague buildings. At number 15, Deutsche Bahn ICE 1 Paris. Four cars by Rev O. Yes, some more trains for your train collection. At number 14, yes, some more trains for your train collection. It's the Stadler Flirt OC Transpo. Five cars by Rev O. Rev O pushing for the creator of the week, but will they grab it? At number 13, it's the UK Road Project Revived Motorway Prop Pack by McWalshman. Yeah, McWalshman, a great creator of British assets, and this is some really nice networking accessories. At number 12, some more stuff to go with it. It's the UK Road Project's Revived Motorways Pack by McWalshman. Yeah, grab them both. Why not? At number 11, Givenchy Shop by Raccoon. It's one of these little shop units that you can either have it as a standalone or push it into an existing building. Looks really good. At number 10, into the top 10, Hertzmansky Vienne by Jens. Okay, this is where my language skills are being challenged to the extreme. Well done, Jens. At number 9, Reimers Hofgarten. <laughs> Help. By Jens. <laughs> Thank you, Jens. <laughs> You're my best friend. At number 8, Tram Depot Dresden. I can just about manage that German word. By Sven Berlin. Sven are coming back with some more tram assets. Thank you very much for those. And number seven, we have the Subaru Legacy 4. Uh, ID is 4, yep. By Palix, just checking those. I was at PAL 9, I'm not sure. But anyway, a great car asset. At number six, commercial building by Jens. And Jens, with this third item in the chart, has become this week's creator of the week. So well done, Jens, for that one. At number five, it's a McDonald's by a Raccoon. Similar to the uh, Givenchy building, this is one of those flat little assets that you can use to push into an existing structure. At number four, the Labiante, hopefully got that right, 1.41 map theme by Arnold J. River, BSC, SSE, and a great theme it is too. At number three, it's City Hall by King Leno. King Leno, old friend of the show, really glad to see him producing even more amazing American assets. Well done for that one, King Leno. At number two, we have Glass Elevators by Ronick69. Not quite sure how I'm going to be using these, but they've definitely got to be played with, haven't they? Great work Ronix but who's at number one the answer cuboid with the cargo hold fix it's a mod that enables you to restrict your vehicles your trains and your planes running along with seven percent fill they'll hold around a little bit longer waiting for a fuller fill load so you go cargo hold fix by cuboid today's number one well, thanks for watching, for commenting, for liking, and for subscribing. You may also notice Raccoon has been added to the Creators Hall of Fame. Well done for breaking through that 100-point barrier, Raccoon. I'll see you next week for more Steam Weekly Charts.